Hey guys, Joel Siegman here. Going to be going over another variation of the single leg swap. We already went over the basic single leg swap. We also went over the lunge with the swap. Uh, what we're going to do here is something a bit different. So with the normal swap, again, we're just standing on one leg, taking the kettlebell, swapping it back and forth. Again, really good for stabilization. The one thing that it's missing is it's not forcing the muscles in our ankles and feet to turn on rapidly. So what we're going to do, we're going to progress this into more advanced variation and work on rate of stabilization development, just like rate of force development where you have to turn on the muscles quickly to achieve proper force. We're going to have to turn on the muscles around our feet and ankles rapidly in order to stabilize our body. So there's also going to be some reactive stabilization. We're going to have to react to that different pull and direction. Again, re-react to the other side, react again when we switch over, and we're going to do it rapidly. So, instead of doing this smoothly, like I did for the normal swap, again, single leg, and I, this isn't always successful, but I'm going to go ahead and do this. This is actually pretty heavy for this. Boom. Hold it. Boom. Hold it. It's almost like we're tossing it. Boom. Oh, almost lost that one. That's tough. Trust me. My whole body is working on that. My core, even my lats, upper back, a lot of the postural muscles, but particularly my ankles and feet are gripping aggressively into the floor because if they're not, I'm going to tip over quickly. And again, this is working on rate of stabilization development and some reactive stabilization. So excellent exercise. Again, this is just a rapid single leg swap with a kettlebell. Give it a try. Excellent exercise, right? Thanks.